Tonight on the name... Tonight on the... Tonight on the Unnamed Talk Show, we have Librarian and Backroom Anime Mob Notes. Hey, I am not an anime and mob. And for <laughs> our recurring co-host, as always, totally not Miku, and of course, we've got me, your favorite, favorite host, and your only host you're ever going to get because, you know, fuck you, I'm the best, Catbox GMZ, also known as, you can refer to me as, Rosie, or Catbox the Great. Welcome Thank to the you, show, Notes, nerds. for appearing on this show in, like, short notice of a minute. Hey, uh, listen, I'm not just, uh, a background character. I'm not a mob character. I'm a librarian! I am that one guy that you see on the library scene each and every single day. ZP, you hear something? I, I don't know. It sounds like, sounds like some sort of whisper in the background. Um, uh, yeah, you're gonna have to, uh, become a background. Stand You're gonna have to get rid of that redding green hair in the ears and just have brown hair with brown eyes. Oh, okay, oh, okay, fine, fine. I'll, 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 I'll get my, I'll get my god armor up right here. Here we go. <laughs> look, at this, look at this, look at this stupid mob. He's just the Baron. You, you calling me mob? I will show you the wrath of true kingdom, look, of true godhood. It's the emperor of Air. Earth. One now, cannot now be outshined like, by you. Now you look like the generic first enemy people fight in anime. <laughs> I'm actually it's supposed to be a name. No, 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 I'm supposed to be a secret boss. Not, not, oh, oh god dang it, I just can't he, win. He's gonna be the boss that betrays you later on. How does it feel to be a background mob? I am, first and foremost, I would like to reiterate again, I am not a background mob. Okay. Secondly, okay. Um, I am a librarian of the archive. I, I do records and stuff and, well, people would say it's just normal, uh, it's just normal records of perhaps some history or just normal facts that people know each and every day, or maybe special events. Uh, no. Well, uh, my work is a little bit more grand than that, but mm -hmm. for now, I'm just, a, I'm just a simple librarian that you can find in your local area. Good thing is I don't go to libraries, then. Uh -huh. Thank you, audience. Thank you, audience. He doesn't read. Thank you, uh -huh. back. Well, thank you, uh, uh, dumpster man. Did he have a name? I can't remember his name. Well, we do have a homeless man in the studio yeah. that likes to watch the live show. Yeah, 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 he's one of our own. He's he's really... I think I'm thinking about hiring him, though, so he can go around passing out t-shirts. Catbox t-shirts, you know, in the crowd. Like, get your t-shirts here, get your t-shirts. Why is it? Catbox he's just got a picture of How long have you been streaming for, Nerds? Well, I've been streaming for uh, about a year and a half. Oh, yes. We've noticed that most of the people I have streamed, I mean, I was streaming about a year ago. Mm -hmm. um, so, what made you want to become yeah, well, a VTuber fan? Let, let, let me ask this question. I want to get correct. Oh. What made you want to become a VTuber? What makes me want to become a VTuber? Well, it's pretty much that simple. Um, For the myriad of reasons, these are probably common reasons that you could pretty much expect an answer from almost to every other VTuber. Number one, I do like anime. Number two, I think, um, I think it's, uh, I think it's a great deal for me to be a V streamer because, well, first and foremost, I'm originally an introvert and I want to break out of my shell and I, I, I think it's, I honestly think it's really, really fun. Uh, like, name your biggest waifu. My biggest waifu. Technically, there's like, um... I, I don't ac exactly have a waifu at the moment, or... I, I don't actually favor one, I just I just love them all equally. Uh, what or... was your first anime crush, then? <laughs> you're, you're really shoving this question down my throat. <laughs> I am. Alright, alright, alright. 
Uh, all right, all right, all right. Okay, maybe I could tell you guys. Um, I guess my very first is um somebody called Rin Tosaka from oh, the Rin Fate Tosaka. series. That is that is a very oh, that is a Rin very Tosaka good very good choice. Side. Very good choice. You you I sir you sir maybe a background mm. character, but you have taste at least. I am not a background character. Sure, fine. Right, if you don't want to be a background character, I'll at least make you a minor side Full character. Full ground character. Okay, uh, minor no, no, character no, no, sounds no, no. good. You are a minor background character, man. How, wait, how how is that any better? Huh. You can take that or go back to being a mob. Okay, fine. I'll take the side character game. So, there well, we yeah, go. I'm actually Look at that. See, I'm not just a mob character. I'm not a mob character. I'm a side character. That one character where it appears at most comedic moments, that is exactly who I am. No, oh, I am. Hey, You're the antagonist. I don't need to stand for this shit, you know. <laughs> CP, I, you know I can replace you. So I bet you better turn that antagonist to either main antagonist or main character. Main antagonist sounds better. Fine, I'll take it. See, see, we can we can get to common ground. What made you come up with the design of your character? The thing is, I do wanted to have um some sort of style in relations to the animation production of the animation style of Type Moon. That's uh, what I was going Fine. for. And there are so many notable characters in uh, the Type Moon series. Um, it's just, my hair is like, um, my hairstyle came from one of my most fa fam favorite characters. I, I done this idea on the context of, I, I don't want to be too great. I don't want to be too bad either, but just about just enough as an acceptable person in which I can or cannot outshine anyone else. I, I just don't want to hug the spotlight. That's, that's a good, that is a good thought to have. Because look at me. I deserve the spotlight. <laughs> you can praise me now. In fact, you are. But, um, yes, you are totally great there. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Um, thank you. Yeah, thank you, thank you. Um, Make sure you clap for him as well. Yes. Oh, Woo, oh, clap on you. I like, I like. All right. All right. Next you know, question. You know I have ears. You know, I realize I have cat ears, right? What are you talking about? I mean, yes, you do have adorable uh, cat ears. Thank you. Thank, thank you. I don't know what you said because my ears have been very good since the accident, you know. And... The accident? What kind of accident? I'm interested to know this accident. He's having uh, flashbacks. <laughs> oh, oh, sorry. 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 Um, what now? Yes, oh, no, it's, what is the craziest thing ever happened to you on stream? Uh, the craziest thing that uh, happened to my stream is, first and foremost, untimely crashes. Second and, form, uh, second and foremost, um, the other times were pretty much me actually doing play of the game, whereas I'm expected to lose a lot, but I actually, I, I miraculously <laughs> won. And being raided while my stream is actually collapsing because um, my Twitch connection was, um, my connection to the Twitch servers was collapsing and I was raided by eight or ten people. Um, oh, really? That was, I was like, oh god damn it, that was embarrassing. My Twitch literally had to collapse on me at that moment of me just being raided by someone else. Oh, and my, my Twitch was, was, uh, was collapsing on me when we did the crab game. Every single game wasn't for for Twitch being like fuck you. But, uh, the reason why you can't win is because Leo is killing everyone. She killed more than half the entire lobby. It was in it was insane. I I couldn't keep up. Like CP? my only goal there <laughs> is literally just to survive. I didn't even harm a single person in our entire game of crab game and. Here we have Leo, who's like bloodthirsty and girling. I mean, I was a little bloodthirsty too. I pushed. I did a little yeah. bit of pushing of you too. I've got myself the co-host replacement. Her name is Silica, and she's really cute. But she doesn't talk. I mean, <laughs> she's there the mascot. 
after me, of course. Be like, meow, 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 meow. <gasps> wow, so look at that. Such a great question. She asks, why are you such a bitch? <laughs> well, maybe you can say this back. Meow, 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 meow. So, yes. what, what is um, it, what's a game? game? Tell me a game that you liked when you were younger. Uh, the game that I- oh yes, um, if if you lived around the 1990s- I did not. I'm so- oh, that is unfortunate. Well, the greatest games that I think you boys will love, um, that, uh, that would have been Metal Slug. Metal Slug is one of the classic ones. Like, back in the day, Metal Slug was the hype of gaming. At least one of the most popular titles. Then it got uh, overshadowed by whatever PC gaming had to offer because the PC gaming was uh, was growing. It was a growing industry. Soon enough, the arcade games like Metal Slug uh, and the old Super Mario games were getting uh, getting shadowed by its glory. It is still good to this day, but if you guys lived in that time, oh man, Metal Slug was the one of the I was best. Born to like bang out. after. 1999. Oh. Nine. Oh. Wait. <laughs> okay, 2000s. Wait, wait. Then you should have, like, um, heard... You could have at least heard of this, of the Metal Slug series, right? Have you heard about it? Was it, was Honestly, it, was it a PC game? It was primarily a Game Boy game, a PlayStation oh. game, and now a PC game. You disappoint me. Objection, heresy. We got a fake gamer right here. <laughs> Listen here. Um, Maybe you should time, introduce. When I was younger, that. when I was younger, I was mostly playing games on my PlayStation Three, such as Little Big Planet and Little Big Planet. I did a lot of Little Big Planet and Little Big Planet. Yeah, and big. I mean, if you go back on my channel, you can see, like, my very first video ever is Little Big Planet Part Two. I mean, Little Big Planet 2, Part 2. My don't ask where Part 1 is, because I don't know. It's just got lost. It's, it's gone to the ether. Lost in time. Well, apart, from, right. me apart from Metal Slug, there's, uh, there's always plants and zombies, in which I enjoy very dearly. Plants vs. Zombies? Oh, uh, yes. Yeah, I actually forgot that it came out. Yeah, it, it, was, really, uh, it was really a great game. A lot, yeah, a lot. Because the dev, the gaming dev just know what their audience want. They want content. They want replayability. But nowadays, devs are starting to forget that fundamental rule of why they're gaming developers. They only care about the money. Uh, was, was that, was that, oh. was that, well, whatever, was that, was that from outside me or was that from... Your mic. What? Excuse me? Uh, yeah. I didn't well, hear fireworks, anything. Fireworks, fireworks, fireworks. <laughs> Maybe that's just me, cause, but I didn't hear a big... <sighs> oh, there it is. My boy, you must be hallucinating. I Quick, am. we need him to get to a medic he, back he, right he's now. On, he's on catnip. <laughs> Have you been taking oh. catnip before? Uh, oh, sorry, Silica. Sorry, Silica. Sorry again. <laughs> you know... Yes, I do. So, how's life being a scribe? I have to record everything you witness. Isn't it quite a tiring job? Uh, first and foremost, scribe? yes, it can be a little bit tedious, but then, whatever I do capture, whatever I do record, there, there's some interesting information that comes in and out, uh, in, each and every time. Uh, there's, uh, there's surprisingly good information, there's wacky information and um there's like and there's just that kind of event that I'm recording that I wish it never did happen but I, I, well it happened and I just have no other choice but to archive it you such, such do as, not know such the as things that walking I've in actually walk into the girls restroom in the elementary school and be like oh no why is there more why is there no urinals in here that's kind of weird Send me to use the bathroom, <laughs> walking out, looking at the panel, but like, oh, that's why. This is it's the girls' restroom. 
Hopefully yeah, no that's one noticed. Uh, and then you yeah, see... Yeah, that's a common case for 11-year-olds. Yeah, yeah. Oh, hey, shout out to all my 11-year-olds out there, you know? <laughs> it's not suspicious at all. <laughs> Alright, take that back, take that back. Alright. How about you all get off here, that's different for you. Got any more uh, questions for our guest here? Count Fox? Who was an inspiration to you? My inspiration, well... That's just, uh, my inspiration is actually a fictional character mm. from the... Oh, for, for streaming? Is it for streaming? Yeah, it's for, for streaming, for streaming. Who, who, what, you, what, to, what, what, VTuber, not even, YouTuber, VTuber, whatever, made you looking like, I want to be a content creator, and one day, I'm going to kick the wrath by suppressing them. There is one name, and I'm pretty sure we all know his name. His name is Markiplier. 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 <clears throat> Hello, everybody, my name is Markiplier. Welcome back to Fantasia. He was um, Mar Markiplier was uh was a content creator, and I he, do well, love the content he, that he, he still, dishes out. Yeah. He's still a content creator. Yeah, he's yeah. both a content creator and he could be a streamer at the same time. But the yeah. point is, the reason why I in uh why I'm inspired to do streaming is because you know I want to make some content like him too, make people happy, make people Markiplier laugh. Um, is a great option. He, to have a has a as a sensei. Um, inspiration, you know. I don't think he would have, have um, he would divert some resource it, into it, because he barely handled Ethan, though. I think. Barely handled Ethan? What do you mean? Like, you didn't... Oh, never mind. I'm not supposed to say the title out loud. Oh, John oh. Unis Why's that? Unis Honest. Unis Honest. What about it? Yes. Can we move on to the next question? <laughs> what, what happened, what I happened felt to, like we stumbled across a conspiracy. What happened to Nose Honest? Uh, okay, let, let me just uh, let me just clarify. Um, and uh, to answer the question about whether Markiplier can be a good teacher or not, well, it we haven't exactly seen. Uh, we haven't fully exactly seen how he teaches other people. So it's too soon for me to judge whether he'd be a good teacher or not for when it comes to content creation or be yeah. a good stream coach. So I would not I would not have a straight answer for that one. That's what I'm trying to get at. All right, all right. Okay. okay well, I, yeah, I guess we can move on to the next part of the show then, where mm -hmm. you were allowed to ask me one singular question. Do, 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 do. I've not been able to do this for a while. Do, 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 do. Well, you did it last time. Yeah, well, what do you mean I did? I did it last time, really? Yeah. Oh, I did? All right. Do, 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 do. I guess it's been a little bit since the last recording. And, and the time before that. I did? Yeah. I don't know. I, I just feel like a lot of people this season have been able to, you know, diss out questions real quick. like, bah, bah, bah. Or maybe it's not during the recording. I don't know. Are you okay then? No, it's yeah, okay. your brain damage. Sure. Yeah, uh, oh, oh, I'm supposed to a to ask the question. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, flipping around, it's time for you to ask me one single question, one only. What time offer? Do, do I have permission to ask more questions? Absolutely not. Okay. I'll, I'll allow. I'll allow it for one additional question. Very well. Then here is my question. Um, what is your ultimate goal as a VTuber, Catbox? That's the question that I've, it's been looming over my head because you've been building up this amazing community and uh, I'm kind of curious. What, well, what, 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 what kind of goal do you have in mind? In of building course, this ultimately, I would like to do this kind of stuff for a living. You know, I enjoy doing it. Um, cause I honestly I hate doing like manual labor type stuff, stuff like like that. So this is the only kind of work I actually enjoy doing. You know, I like entertaining people. I like saying stupid shit and doing shit for the lols. You know, so I mm. I hope 
I I can get to a point where I can I can I can do this, you know. And I also like um, meeting meeting people doing this show. That's why I always why that's why I always want to push to do it, and why I'm always like disappointed when a guest is on Middle Make It or uh, doesn't respond. Not calling names, of course, you know. <laughs> of course, you know, I, there's, there's not like there's two people that have not responded to me, you know. Um, mm. I, I just really enjoy doing this, you know. I just really enjoy it. But have a good welcoming community of like just full of YouTubers, you know, as well. Just have like just have like a big group I can, you know, just point, just put something out there. It's like, hey, I'm going to do this soon. Who's up for it? You know, have a just kind of like a close knit group of friends. Well, actually, that answers uh, uh, half of the questions I have for you. So, any questions for me? Oh, uh, you said you had a sec. I allowed, I allowed two questions. Do you have a, do you have a second question you wanted to ask? No, no, we can move on. Right, uh, I right, think right, I conglomerated. I conglomerated two questions into one. ZP. You know what time it is. Yes. Do you want to guess what time it is, uh, Lights? No, no, listen, the guest is not a part it, of this. The guest is not a part of this. <laughs> it's just me and you, see, it's be, this, this, this is a me and you right. thing. It's, it's random fact time. It's there you it go. Is. It is random fact. Whee! I don't know what's happening. They jumped off a cliff. That's what happened. All right. That, 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 was, that was the insane, uh, Catbox fan from last season that we had to uh, take out from from the studio. Oh, you already kicked them out. Anyway, um... oh, yeah, we we had to ban them from the from from the set because they tried to break in a couple episodes ago. Uh, and then sounds... uh, we we caught them trying to break in before the start of the show. So I had the bodyguard, being the homeless man who lives out back, um, take them and throw them off the top of the studio. On that... top of this, yeah, I thought yeah, he took him somewhere. Oh well, no, that is so mean. What you gotta do? No, no. What what you're gonna do is you're gonna ask the bodyguard to lead the man to lead the oh, intruder with ice already, cream and he, money. He, he's already dead. He's already dead. So it's a little too late for that, you know. Keep that in mind if you ever cross me. That is um. That is actually terrifying. All right, I won't. We're gonna have to have to cut this plan out, Catbox. <laughs> No, I'll, I'll, I'll make sure to cut it out. Don't worry. Yeah, uh, me. Make sure to cut uh, it out. All right. Let, let's see what the random fact is. The first speeding ticket was given to a man going 80 miles per hour. That was random fact. Yay. Applause. 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 That was a random fact. I, th I thought it was... um. I thought it was like going in a quiz B or something, but all right. No, 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 of course not. Uh, it's the part of the show where we play a game, the three of us, yes. and I win every time. Hey, no how is how is that a? He doesn't win all the time because he doesn't play yeah. the game. Oh, okay. Under that's understandable. My memory, that's understandable. My, if my memory serves me right, I think I won last time, right? So what we're going to do okay. is we're going to guess um, what these one-star anime reviews were talking about. What anime they were talking about. Oh, okay. Literally, Pokemon Battles. Pokemon Battles, but with, hum with humans in love. Okay, if we're going on Pokemon battles, then then I would be like, "Hey, um, y you know this one right next to me? He's gonna be my Pokemon now." Is it well, Fate's Day Night? Um, no, it's not Fate. What do you think? Is it one with Fate? Literally, oh, you want yeah. me to guess what 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 they're referring to? Yeah, what anime they're referring yeah. to? Like my this guess is Fate Apotheca. This is not fate. Fate is a little bit different than that because yeah, you, you don't. Should. Yeah, ZP, you, you're you are focusing more on the Pokemon battles with humans. It is Pokemon battles, but with humans and love. There's love. Oh, it's uh, I think that is a data live. Is this? No. I... 
JP, uh, I'll, I'll let you give... I'll give you another chance to guess because it seems you ignored the love pretty heavily. Alright. If it's going to be all about love... Uh, uh, Kaguya-sama, love is war. Correct, yes, it is. Edgelord would have been a better name for this rubbish. Imagine an angsty teenager on a power fantasy trip you have this series. Poor story structure, poor adversaries, and stakes, just poor all around. I regret spending time on this. Alright, there's two series that come in mind. Um, same. Um, or just name one, each of you. Okay, I'm gonna say Sword Art Line. Alright. Notice, what do you think? Crap, I was thinking about redo of the healer because of the edge lord. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, that's basically my answer. I don't know what this one is. Right. Final answers. Those are your final answers? Yep. Yep. Alright, so you are both wrong. It is, in fact, referring to Overlord. What? Oh! Which I mean, I, but, think, yeah, I, I, I think, I think the fact that yeah one the cleanest fact that it's a adult. teenager he's not even an, yeah the fact he's not an angsty teenager he's yeah, he, like a working adult yeah he was an adult and two he's not a power fantasy trip either he is just like in a situation where he yeah. has very strong and powerful creatures that looked up to him as this completely all-powerful evil being, there are a lot of boob lady, with is very inappropriate. So I do not like. So I rate one out of ten. Elmo came with that AK forty-seven. Mm. Uh, I'm not, I don't think this you're is... gonna. I don't think you're gonna get this at all. Yeah, it doesn't narrow it down. We're, we're not. This there's is no too way. vague. No, there's, yeah, no, there's no, this way is no way you're getting this. No way you're getting this. Take a guess. I'll give you a hint. It's an isekai. Is it demon maid? Is it? I don't demon maid. Uh, dragon like, maid. It's an isekai. It's probably all she's dragon maid. It's an isekai anime. Is it the fruit of evolution? No idea what that is. Okay. Um. There's only a few titles left now. Uh, okay. So it's an isekai anime with a lot of women's overly proportionate chests. Is it one about a guy who reincarnates and it's got a harem? So it sounds rather vague in itself. He isn't reincarnated at all. You said it was an isekai. Well, yeah, but isekai doesn't technically. Oh, mean. so he was transported. Okay. Yeah, he was um, technically transported. A hero who earns a lot of boobs. As I say, I refrain from answering, so I will not confirm nor deny if he's a hero. It's a hero. Uh, it's not. It's not a shiro. No, it's hero ridden. Or heroin. Or heroin. Are, are you not, guys not heroin. Are, are you guys talking about drugs now? Uh, listen here, okay. Just well, we take are your now. guesses, alright? Again, I'll... If this is a person's misconception of a single anime, if I'm going to assume this, the only misconception I could think of is... This one, uh... Life... No, wait, no. That's, that's, an, that's a complete piece of guy. No, I got nothing. What's right. the answer? So it was Kanosuba. What? That was the. No, come on! Kanosuba, oh, that's the one thing that I did. That's my guess! No! He did reincarnate. Well, he did. No, he, he did not reincarnate. He did die. But. Yeah, he did die. He was not <laughs> reincarnated. Thank you, Notes, for coming on here. Uh, like, on the drop of a hat. Thank you very much. Uh, you can find him. In the notes, I mean description down below, and you can, you can also plug yourself in. Notice. Thank you ah, for coming to the show. <laughs> I see what you did there. I did on accident. Yeah, you're gonna pay for that. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Uh, thank you, everybody, for having me. I am Notes of the Archive. I stream on Twitch. I do some videos on YouTube on the side as well. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you're out there in the world. I hope you're all having a lovely day. Alright, and 
because you know where to find ZP. Um, yeah, so you can find me on YouTube, totally not on YouTube, and on Twitch, not not Twitch, Twitter, not on YouTube, because my Twitch name is different again. In the window. Oh, and in the window, where you know it's something that sounds normal to normal people. Maybe if it really drills your mind, it could be taken in a different direction. Oh, in the window. Yes. Yeah, and it's uh, what what's in the window? The, the, okay, let's you know, you know what it is. My hot ass pie. That's what it is. My oh. friend, my, it's, my, it's my freshly made cream pie. That's what it is. Uh, uh, uh. I don't want to touch your cream pies. I, I, I don't I don't get it. You told me to say in the window, but uh, I don't know what's in the window. I told you it's my like, it's my hot steaming cream you, pie. You want some? He he's losing it. Look, don't worry. I'll Your... give I'll give I'll give you some cream pie. All right. Don't worry. Is it is it some coconut cream pie or? Do you like coconut cream pie? Yes, 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 I do. Yes, I do. Right, coconut so it is, cream it pie is, is the It is. It is some coconut cream pie. That is true. Yes. I'll say it once more. Coconut cream pie is the best. Alright, you heard it first. Nuts is gonna eat my coconut cream pie. Yeah, definitely. Wait, wait, like wait, 